Okay. So here's the bar. There's crags here, and then there's steps and a ruin and the sky. Let's you look. You know at the what? Sky. If you were to document all those crags, does that mean we're gonna have a crags list? Very cute. Why did I invite you? Sorry. Okay. Look at the ruin. Uh, parts of the structure are indistinct and fluid, as if they were swimming in and out of existence. Shall we pull a rocky and climb up the stairs? <laughs> one by one, over the course of the next 15 minutes, your motley crew reaches the stop at top of the steps. Josie gets there ahead of everyone else and mocks the rest of you just slightly. Noah is the most affected by the climb and immediately sits on the top couple of the steps. Oh, come on! We just gave him a bunch of testosterone. He's like a bodybuilder now. Yeah, we're off, though. That he sticks a good. cigarette in his mouth and lights it, all in one fluid, economical motion. His friend's concerned disapproval burns his back. Despite the vibrantly shifting sky, there is no wind to blow out his lighter, no discernible movement in the air at all. The smoke Noah exhales hangs immediately in front of him, refusing to either drift or disperse, suspended like fruit cocktail and jello. You can sense Noah's confusion better than you can sense your own. What a beautiful metaphor. Ralph trots a short distance from the cloud and sits, panting, facing Callahan's. A tiny whine escapes his throat. The deep disturbance he feels at the complete lack of any scent in the atmosphere is almost palpable. Maybe it's just the occasion mixed one-to-one -one with your bottomless exhaustion, but you suddenly realize that you're sensing what everyone else is feeling, and that they're all discovering the same sensations within themselves. Say. The rise and fall of everyone's breathing synchronizes. You form in your mind a comment about Siamese sub uh, subtuplets, but before you can voice it, everyone hears it coming. The sensation evaporates almost instantaneously, leaving behind an equilibrium you weren't even aware of was lacking. Each of you observed a little bit of all the other's most acute emotions. Alfie's agitation, Ralph's olfactory unease, the professor and Marianne, and your own weary well, excitement. somebody just shoot us up with psychic Prozac? That was the real stuff. Mass hypnosis? Isn't that redundant? It's this place. Yeah, what about this place anyway? You get to your feet and explore the ruin. Walking from one end to the other, you come across a single corridor leading away from the center point of the center point of the fa uh, facade. Dude, right. I think there was a room like this in the Matrix too. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna save my game here. Um, Where's room? the key master? I am key the maker. gatekeeper. Eh. Are you the key master? Does it get me laid? Uh, and no. So. Okay. Actually, this is going to be a word problem, if I remember correctly. Ooh, I like puzzles. Mm -hmm. I don't think we can open these doors yet. So here's a purely unopened door. Wait, I noticed that our um, inventory has gotten a lot lighter since we're here. What do we have left? We have a chocolate bar, a original Faxon Castoroga pencil. Fancy. Uh, Ralph's whistle, my favorite thing in the whole game, the tire iron, our wallet that has no money in it, our license, and our photo of our family. Can we power up the tire iron? No, but we can look at it. How are Pretty. you supposed to iron a tire with this? Uh, I don't know <laughs> what happened. Okay, let's look at the. Let's start looking at the doors. All right, you're gonna want to start writing these down. A brass plaque on the door says "toothpick." Toothpick. The brass plaque on the door reads "thieve." Was it thieve? Thieve. Okay. I'm actually writing this down. Good. Do it. The single word one is inscribed on the plaque mounted on the door. All right, one. got it. What kind of names are these? I don't think they're names. If they aren't names, what are they? He's a fast writer. He is really fast. It sounds like he's ripping that paper apart, though, when he writes. It sounds like somebody's just bumping <laughs> up against the microphone. Um, hanging on the door is a brass plaque that reads best. Toothpick thief one best. Okay. Okay, those don't those doors don't matter. We only need these. This door says this door says says. Says. Mm -hmm. Plaque on the door reads airy. Airy. Okay. If these aren't names, how does he expect us to find him? We still haven't tried every door. Yeah, but he could have said to his last door on the right or something. He's gotten a lot That'd of cheap thrills easy. out of watching Jake jump through hoops tonight. Yes. I think he gets off on it. He likes to see us rack our little brains for his entertainment pleasure. Okay. More words. The name on the door is Mime. 
mime. There the secret word is mime. not be a mime, mime. back there. Other. The brass plaque on the door says other. Oh, I think it's a code. Everyone turns to look at Al. Well, it's what I'd do. Okay. All right, you got all those written down? I do. Now, Here's what, do what you we have to do. This is a word puzzle. We have to put the words in order uh, to open them. Hmm. As you can see, now they're all labeled. So this is the toothpick door. This is the thieve door. This is the one door. Best says airy. What kind, of, what kind of sentence can we make out of this, though? You can, make, you can definitely make a sentence. We can also talk to our companions to see if they have any ideas. Who do you want to talk to? We can talk to Josie, Piotr, Noah, Al, Joe, or Ralph. Uh, we should talk to Al because he seems he knows most about codes. Hey, Al. Yeah, you. You know, I'm actually enjoying this. I'm confused. Ever seen lighting effects like this before? Or just wanted to make sure you hadn't gone into shock? You should be confused. I'm confused. About what? <laughs> um, it, there's nothing we can really ask about oh, that has to do Oh, I thought we codes. could ask about the I'm word puzzle. I'm confused about no. what I was originally confused about. Never mind. Confusion. Just wanted to make sure you hadn't gone into shock. No, I'm doing okay. A little jumpy, but okay. Thank you. You're very welcome. Um, I guess we should talk to Josie. She's the only one who seems like she has any more brains amongst this outfit. Hey, Josie. Pussycat. Right here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's new? Pussycat? Whoa, You have any whoa, idea whoa. how to get into these doors? If I knew how, I'd do it, damn it. Now Janet. we've upset her, yeah. Talk to? Piotr, let's talk. Yeah, boss. You want now, to help is there us any, out uh, here? I am. Hang on, hang on. Let me concentrate. Just keep trying, and when I get it, I'll let you know. Now, is there any rule that says they have to be like the single words? Can we do it like it was doing those word puzzles back in Callahan's and kind of combine them? That's exactly what we're supposed to be doing. Hey, look, I'm smart. So I would start with mime. Okay, mime. My mother says. Yes. Wait, wait. My mother says. My Mime mother other says toothpick. Wait a minute, I got this. Toothpick. Yeah. The best one. That's correct. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, I'm being useful. Did I actually open these doors? Maybe I have to, oh, maybe I have to knock on them. Okay, so I'm gonna knock on the mime door. You knock, then pound on the door. You get no, then no answer. Actually, hang on, babe. No, we're good. From no, all right. around you, you hear a disembodied voice say, that's a good start. Okay. Mime, and then other, knock on. You knock on the door with mixed results. The knocking part goes fine. The follow-up is anticlimactic. Knock um, three times on the door. We can roll back the carpet me. or rub it. Let's rub the carpet. Roll back the carpet. No static. Interesting the atmosphere they have here. Is no my mother, where says, says, knock on. You knock three times, but no one meets you in the hallway. <laughs> no, okay, uh, my mother says, where's the toothpick door? Toothpick. Uh, I can't believe I got this puzzle. I feel so, uh, I feel so accomplished. Is Thieve next? But I'm thieve. getting no validation. She's ignoring me. Shut up, I'm knocking on doors here. Uh, I lost my part. The said. Uh, well, you just did the toothpick door. No, I did the thieve door. The very. Thieve, best airy one. Best one. Booyah! I am smart. You knock on the door and open, and it opens. You Come knocked on, on the in. open doors. Come on in. Hey, very it's him. Good, very it's good. Jesus. Come in. We're in heaven. Nice office. That's exactly correct. I mean, it's my first attempt at a nice office. Do you mind if I ask what, uh, well, what He's been in the I bar the entire time. If I wanted to rent, say, a small office in the area? No, this is just something I threw together because I hoped you were coming. A semi-illusionary interface between my world and the one you exist in. It's a little hazy. Well, I'm a little hazy. I didn't remember all the details. I didn't spend much time on your little ball there. 
but should be a safe environment for you. I checked for holes in the floor, and I made sure not to have any... What is it you people worry about? Uh, tropical oils in the atmosphere? That's very close. Thank you for trying. I trust your trip went smoothly. The anesthetic. Good stuff, eh? The bottle. Yes, my private label. Well, the board is meeting, so now that you're here, I have a few more notes to go over and we can go in. Go in where? You're going to tell so us where we are? this is the grand finale we, we to sit through a board right, meeting? Right, right. Yeah. At our fates? Right, right. Y yeah. You're outside of your universe. It gets That's more exciting, it. I promise. Case over there, top left. And you're coming with me to convince the board not This is to our cut sad your and lonely your universe. universe right no, here. said we're top left. We're the, the glowing, pulsating, cool looking and ones. Like this the ones one? we all yes. create here are funded by the But it's moving. Endowment. I thought they were shutting us now, the down. The being cut and we well, uh, I mean, they haven't shut us down well, yet, so we're we're still lively and uh, viable. Like I'm getting tired of listening energy. to this guy. I'm getting distracted. His voice is very soothing. It's the I want the stock ticker. So they'll just. I wonder what he's playing the on this computer. What if that's like laser suit Larry? We'll freeze to death. It's Space Could Quest. Be. See, about the There's time a universe they cut off on the power, it. They Jesus is talking. Time, too. So you Jesus won't have a chance Sudoku. to freeze to death. You'll just stop. And they'll Jesus recycle the matter too. later on for lawn furniture, <laughs> probably. Big lawn furniture. Uh, what? We probably should have been paying attention, but Let's we weren't. Let's look at our universe. I'm curious. Okay. This one, right? Yes. Universe orb. Take. Please don't touch the universes. There are a lot of wires running in back of there. Ah, so that's the secret. We're running on wires. Is this the one you said was our universe? That's it exactly. I call it Raymond. Look at the Raymond the universe. In that universe. I, I said before you know I would have called him it's Cecil. Our God expanding. is very unimaginative. I yeah. hold the unofficial record for keeping my universe is expanding the longest. You know what is very interesting though, right? So that you can tell how he old does it is by stereotypically the fit the, the image of a God or Jesus, and he is running the universe. I wonder if that's you know symbolic for something. Look at his computer. I'm curious what that is. A, fam a familiar symbol on the CPU identifies this as a do it backward 166 megahertz Pentium. Back on Earth, this is the only system that has an extra key on the keyboard for automatically dialing tech support. Do you get the do it backward? No. Hewitt Packard. Oh, Hugh oh, oh, funny. Funny game. Hey, look, a computer game box. You walk around the desk and pick up the box. It looks like a game called Sim Universe. Ooh, I play that. I love Sim games. Inside the box, you find a thick troubleshooting manual, a list of other products from the same company, and a warranty card that hasn't been filled out. Don't you make the same mistake. Fill out and send in your Callahan's Cross Time Saloon warranty card now. It's the only way to see if we can flood your mailbox with our unique brand of classy stuff. Uh, I want to play the game. I want to play the computer game. Take we're, we're already playing. We can't play a game inside of a game. Why? The universe will collapse. It's already collapsing. Even if you were to take the chance of making an enemy out of Parabolus by stealing things off his desk, the box doesn't contain the discuts. Oh, remember, do you remember discs? Like discuts? Uh, unfortunately, yes. Yes, I am a man of I that age. I still have some. You go to turn on the lamp, but you find no switch. Besides, the walls are the iridescent switch. anyway. It doesn't switch. It stays a lamp. Ooh, How do you turn the deep. light on? That is the deep. Light. Never mind. It doesn't switch. It remains a lamp. I'm gonna get a lamp that does not work, and just so I can call, <laughs> just so I can say that when people come over. There was no spoon. There is no lamp. <laughs> can we look at some of the other universes? I'm curious. Sure. Let's, let's see, look at the blue uh, one. Let's see what the red one is. Or the red one. The red universe has a small masking tape that le that reads "Rusty." What's causing the color of this universe? Lots of red giants. Supernovas. Is it hell? Grenadine. <laughs> I was gonna say tomato soup, but grenadine is good too. They put too. grenadine in the universe. Is this universe contracting? Snuffy. Yeah. Snuffy. Oh. Snuffy. Why? It's what Maybe I named the pig. Snuffles. The Sorry, I wasn't listening. So we have to like. Uh, let's Raymond look at Snuffy and Rusty. and Rusty. Is this another universe? Yes. This is Lynn. Lynn oh, was Lynn. my first universe, so it's also sort of a good luck charm for... So, that makes it your quasi-mojo. I had a little uh, hunch back at the bar. Oh, a there. hunch. Oh, God, the puns just keep coming. The, no, these puns are the most amazing puns ever written, and that's how the, that's how the books are. The